going to get into marketing. Marketing is one of my favorite things because really in business, marketing and sales have a huge important role to play. So we're going to talk about marketing now. This is a really exciting phase of the, of the uh, business building. And the next phase we're going to do after we understand marketing is work on building the business model itself. And so let's talk about marketing. Okay, so what is marketing? So marketing are all the processes involved in getting a product or service from the manufacturer or the seller to the consumer. This includes creating the product or the service concept, identifying who your customer is, who's likely to purchase it, promoting it or, or telling everybody about it or, or what's really called marketing it, and moving it through the proper selling channels. That means are you going to sell it on the internet, online? Are you going to sell it to friends directly, one-on-one? -on -one? Are you going to sell it on the street corner like a lemonade stand? Is it going to be a service like mowing the grass or lawns that you're going to sell door-to-door? -door? Uh, or, or what is it? So there's a lot of pieces that go into marketing. But fundamentally, when you're building a business, it's all about what solution, which is a product or service, that you're going to sell it to who. And, and those are big anchors. And so you can really work on marketing from the very earliest phases of the business rather than building a product or service and then going out and see who you're going to sell it to. You want to figure that out before you go out and sell your product. Okay, so here we are back to this beautiful coral reef. I just love this because remember, this is an economy. So this is just like a city and so or a community. And it's a community of fish and, and different, um, doing different jobs, different things. And all of these fish, well, they're going to they're gonna want different things. So, for instance, this guy, this guy really spends more time around the, the, the seaweed and stuff like that. So he's going to need different products and services than one of these other fish might need that are out there swimming around in the deeper water and it isn't like living right on the reef. And how about this guy? Now this guy's down just like this one, deep, deeper down in the reef. So this fish or this person is going to have different needs and different wants, different desires than some of these other fish. So if we're coming up with products or services to sell, we would sell each of these target customers, these fish, different things, different services, different price points, different quality levels, because they are doing different things than everybody else. So uh, in a reef like this, just like an economy, there's a lot of competition, but everybody is finding a way to make a living. Some fish are swimming down inside the the rocks and the, and the corals, and they're making a living down there, finding their food. Some fish are swimming all the way around the outside, catching the plankton, and they're not near the, near the rocks at all, but they're somewhere close to the reef in case they need safety, so they could duck in there and hide if they need to, or they might go to sleep in the reef at night. And these fish are, are sort of dancing around, right around the, above the rocks themselves, and there's other fish that'll be swimming through and there'll be crabs down in the sand, but they're all making a living. They just happen to be doing different things. And it's the same way in business. We can be successful in business, even with competition, if we go find those people that are doing the things that we can service. And hopefully there's not as many uh, people servicing everybody.